Hi, you're watching Hexus TV, and here we are in Las Vegas for CS 2010. And we're up in the Hilton Suites, where we're in the SciTech booth, and uh, they've got their brand new stuff on display. And the key one for me is the X65F uh, throttle and stick. Uh, now, this is the very first stick ever to feature force sensing. It doesn't move at all, okay? This doesn't do anything. Look, there you go. I'm giving that a wiggle, and it doesn't move whatsoever but what it does do is it senses how hard I'm pulling it one side or the other if you whip over here we've got a split throttle so there you go so you can alternate thrust all that kind of thing okay and then we'll come to the control panel bits later on so I need to explain stuff about that so I'm just gonna show you this in use it's modeled on uh, an f16 uh, stick so you've got the castle hat you've got the uh, dimple and you've got the nipple and then you've got the other hat down here so um, <coughs> CH might be a little bit annoyed about that but uh, let's have a quick go so I'm gonna rest the microphone in here unpause the simulation and probably crash pretty much straight away so twist throttle so you can see me going down the runway there with a twist throttle and I think I'm fast enough up we go and it is really sensitive they've got the sensitive turned up so you can see how easy it is and I should be able to just give it a quick roll off the runway there we are Ooh. I'll probably overstress the aircraft now and ease back there we are and this is really very sensitive indeed now over here on the throttle side you've got the trim so I can trim this down so you see me going down and then I can trim that back going back up and that's not me doing anything and I'm literally just flying with fingertip force now and you see the stick's not moving anyway whatsoever there we are. Right, so let's go over here. I'm going to throttle back. The plane will crash because I want to talk about the uh, throttle side of things. Now, you remember from um, CS uh, 2009, we talked about this, which was the instrument panel, the ProFlight instrument panel. When you buy the X65F, it comes with this little blanking plate which goes on here. We crashed. There we go. It comes with a little blanking plate. You take that off and you can slot in the ProFlight instrument panel and you can add in a further six on these as well. So you can have your airspeed indicator, um, map GPS, whatever you want, and you just control them going up and down here. Uh, the throttle itself, uh, of course, it's being SciTech, so it's fully adjustable for um, how hard, you, you know, uh, um, uh, friction on the throttle itself. Like I say, split one, and you've got more knobs, whistles, dials, buttons than you can ever wish to uh, poke a stick at. And just off camera is uh, Alex from Madcats. Alex? Welcome to Hexus TV yet again. Hello, pleased to be here, Nick. <laughs> totally threw him then because I said I was going to do this bit all on my own. You did? Yeah. There's over 60 individual controls on the X65F. Can you, there you go. that? Only over 60 individual controls and dials. That's more than you can possibly ever need, right? When's it coming out? Uh, so this is going to be shipping in February for 299. 299, is that UK or US? That's yeah, going to be 299 UK, I believe. 299 UK? Yes, and indeed. then you get um, the little software thing which runs all of the pro flight. Yeah, and all not only do you get software, you actually get a couple of uh, flight sim demos as well. Uh, Lock on from Ubisoft, a little demo from those guys as well. Yeah. You get a uh, uh, full software as well that allow you to customize all of your buttons, all of your dials and knobs as well. Okay, there you go. A custom flight experience, Nick. If you don't want to go for the yoke, which will come to you maybe a little bit later. Okay, so check back to Hexes TV for more from the SciTech booth up here in Las Vegas at CS 2010. It's a hell of a ride.